Gonna take a piss. What? Harry, what? Whoa, mister. I got a wife. I don't want no trouble from you. Is this your wife? I got money. More than you'll get for taking us in. I wouldn't make any sudden moves unless you want to be buried here. I take his gun. You want me to what? Just do it. He ain't gonna do nothing with my gun pointed at his head. Buenas noches, amigos. Storm. I got sand all in my eyes. Oh, don't worry about the sand. You'll be protected soon enough. Le voy a pedir a Rosa que se casa conmigo. ¿Qué? Yo no dije nada, man. Oh, tal vez le pregunto a Betty. No empieces, cabrón. Si no le dices nada, alguien va a llegar y luego... Bye bye, Betty. ¿Cómo le digo? ¿Qué quieres decir? Pues que es la mujer más bella del mundo. Que la amo. Que quiero construir una casa y tener muchos hijos. Cuando estás con ella, te quedas mudo. Mejor empiezo con algo fácil. Betty, I love you. Betty, I love you. I love you, ¿sí? Uh, más o menos. I know a little Spanish. He don't know how to talk to girls. <laughs> oh. I haven't seen them in months. You're hurting me. Don't tell me what I want to know. I already told you. There's no more silver, so... People have been moving out of town looking to strike it rich someplace else, and they don't, they don't come back. Don't you lie to me now. <laughs> Why you? I hate whores. Another round of drinks. Oh, I'll get it. Stay. Here, I just leave the bottle. Very kind of you. Sheriff told me the bank closed while we were away. Yeah. We're turning into a ghost town. I don't know how much longer I can stay open myself. I'll pay you as soon as I can. Let's go! supposed to watch after her. That's why I was paying you. I need the extra money, John. I mean, look around. There's no business. Now, hold on. Just wait a second. I 
I thought I'd recognize y'all too. Y'all them bounty hunters, the giant, and the Mexican. You're gonna pay for what you did to her. No, John! Hi, sweetheart. Think she likes him. Must have something real special going on. She's a real good fuck. That's your only warning. Next one goes in your head. Collect the weapons. What do you want? <laughs> You all have garnered quite a reputation for the bounties you've been collecting this year. Some of them are friends of mine. Maybe you should find new friends. One of them was my brother. He was hanged. Because of you. Now, he didn't really get along with his brother. So I might be able to convince him to let it slide. For reasonable fee. Go to hell. Go out of your way to be nice to people. Now everyone stay real calm. Who the hell are you? U.S. Marshal Thomas Tanner. Marshal, that man put a real good beating on this woman. Woman? You mean a whore. What kind of lawman are you? You watch your mouth. I will not tolerate any disrespect. Marshal, I have personal matters settled with these men. So does the U.S. Justice Department. I have a warrant out for their arrest. Any business you may have with them will have to wait. And if it can't? You don't have a choice. The rest of my team will be here any moment. And should any harm come to me, I'm afraid it would not end well for you or your associates. What I can do is offer reward for your assistance in their capture. All right. How much? Now, how much trouble they cause you? How much your brother worth to you, Frank? One thousand dollars should help ease my pain. Clarence? Thousand sounds good, too. His brother was like family to me. Son? Five. Five thousand dollars. Now, don't be greedy, son. I'm sorry, Pa. Um, five hundred? Is that good? He takes after his mother. Thousand dollars for Frank, thousand dollars for Clarence, thousand dollars and five hundred for my son and I. What uh, come out to four thousand dollars? Does that sound right to you, Marshal? When my team arrives, you shall get your money. Give these gentlemen whatever they'd like on me. Where do you think you're going? Go to the sheriff for holding until my team arrives. I'm afraid I'm gonna have to insist you stay here and wait with us. Well, if you insist, how about if I spend some time with them horrors upstairs? You can even post one of your men outside if you like. Fine with me. More than willing. You will alert me when my team arrives. I will. Henry, go with him. Excuse me, Marshal. Do you mind if I spend time with one of them whores? That depends, Sonny. Ma'am, I'm real sorry about what my awe did to you. I still think you're real pretty, though. What the hell are you doing here? <laughs> it's good to see you too, son. Would you uncuff them, please? Get them 
momento que nos estaba pasando que Are you okay, Agent Bruyere? Agent. I can explain. You're working for my father? John, please, I can explain. Johnny, the president has asked me to assemble a special team. Are you kidding me? Is that why she's here? Look, I can't change what happened at Homestead. Innocent people died. That's something we'll have to live with the rest of our lives. But what I'm offering here is a chance to make things right. Well, I'm not a Pinkerton anymore. Neither am I. I work directly for the president now. And I need a man with your skills, Johnny. Well, I haven't done it alone. Oh, yes, of course, the Mexican. I suppose he's proven to be a valuable asset. And a woman? I could say the same. Yo bajo y los detengo. Tú te llevas a Rosie Betty fuera de aquí. No. No, you can't do it alone. Yo no recibo orden de ti. Suéltame. Hey. Lay off him. He better stay calm. Hey, Marshal, is everything okay in there? Marshal! Put the handcuffs on now. Marshal, get on the bed. Betty, get on top of the Marshal. What? Yeah. Now! Hi. Marshall. Mm. <laughs> He's a little busy at the moment. Mm. But if you give me a second to freshen up, oh. I could. Oh, okay. Uh, go, go, go on, Marshall. <sighs> we gotta figure out a way out of here. They have most of the guns. I have an idea. Where are you going? Does it even matter to you anymore? What's your name? H H Harry. Mm. What's yours? I'm Rose. Now, we got another gun. I want to help. What can I do? Betty, just let us handle things. But, just give me a chance. I mean, look at you. I'm not who you think I am, okay? You're just a whore. No, no. You're smart and a good person. When this is all over, you should leave this town just like everybody else. You know, I said you wanted to be a teacher. It's too late for that. Mm. Nothing is ever too late. plan. Well, hello, gentlemen. Your friend shouldn't be the only one having a good time. Which one of y'all would like to come upstairs and join me? <laughs> Why don't you come over here? Keep me company. I think you'd be much more comfortable in a bed. I promise I won't disappoint you. I believe you actually come over here. <laughs> we gotta do something, or they'll kill her. You're not a priority, Johnny. Okay? Déjame. Tengo que ir a ayudarla. Calm down. 
Can we get me? Yo voy contigo. Let him go. It's all right. Don't fight it. Sheriff, when you lure them out, we'll take them out from above. Are you sure he can handle it? You said after Homestead he swore never to take another laugh. He can handle it just fine. Okay. Give us a moment. I never laughed. I think maybe you need a drink to help loosen you up a bit. Very thoughtful of you, but um, I don't drink. Well, then you better start showing me a good time. I can show you a good time upstairs. Ooh, <laughs> she too much for you to handle, Frank. <laughs> Where do you think you're going? I don't feel too good. Your boss hit me pretty hard. I'm gonna go have the doctor check it out. I could take a look at it for you. Need to do this. <laughs> your own, your needs. I don't know the job. Stay back. One shot left. Frank! <laughs> sorry. I'm so sorry. I suppose my condolences for your son wouldn't make a difference either.
sorry about Rose, son. She was a good agent. Come join up with me, Johnny. And make sure she didn't die for nothing. Take care, John. Don't be a stranger. Wait, how, how do you... 